Imagine a secret that is so powerful that it has been kept a secret by some powerful people of ancient history for more than 2,000 years. Indeed, there are secret societies that have protected profound secrets for centuries, and the secrets they hide have the power to change your whole understanding of reality, spirituality, and our whole destiny. Among the most famous of these secret societies are the Freemasons and the Illuminati, whose symbols, rituals, and secrets have fascinated and intimidated many individuals for centuries. But what exactly are these secrets and why have they been hidden for so long? And what happens now that they're coming out into the open? Join us today as we embark on a journey of unraveling the mysteries of the Freemasons and the Illuminati. History is filled with many significant societies and traditions that discovered and gathered profound spiritual insights that guide us in our spiritual and personal journey to this day. One example is the Hermetic Society that has given us profound spiritual wisdom in the form of seven principles, all of which you can find and understand in the Kibalion. Make sure to click the link in the video description below to get a free copy of the Kibalion and find brand new spiritual insights. However, not all historical societies have been open with their spiritual insights, for example, the Freemasons. The Freemasons are often referred to as the keeper of profound ancient wisdom. Their origins are believed to go back to the Middle Ages. However, some historians believe that the roots of Freemasons go much deeper, possibly all the way to the ancient mystery schools of Egypt, Greece, and the Near East. These mystery schools were considered a center for deep spiritual learning, where students went to learn spiritual knowledge and rituals that could connect them with a higher state of consciousness. In these mystery schools, they learn profound spiritual insights that the Freemasons have apparently passed down to generations and guarded closely since centuries, particularly in the form of teachings, symbols, or spiritual rituals. A central teachings in the Freemason philosophy is the idea of spiritual enlightenment, as it teaches that by mastering your own self, you can understand the hidden laws of the universe and align your existence with a higher state of consciousness that has never been reached by an individual before. In terms of symbols, one of the key ones that is associated with the Freemasons is an all-seeing eye, which is often illustrated within a triangle or surrounded by light rays. This symbol is also referred to as the Eye of Providence, and it represents a profound concept, the divine, that is constantly watching over humanity and is connected to the inner eye of spiritual insights that is within us all. Many spiritual traditions have the concept of the third eye, which is closely linked to the eye of providence, as both are believed to grant us access to higher spiritual insights that go above and beyond the physical world. On the other hand, founded by Adam Weishaupt of Bavaria, in 1776, another secret society is the Illuminati, which was originally known as the Bavarian Illuminati. According to statements, their goal was to promote spiritual enlightenment within the world. However, it became associated with more evil intentions, as people started accusing them of aiming to infiltrate governments. However, if we look at the term Illuminati, it is actually derived from the Latin world Illuminatus, which means enlightened. This suggests that the society was not merely interested in political power, but they had a deeper purpose, spiritual enlightenment. And just like the Freemasons, the Illuminati are also believed to guard profound ancient wisdom, which can change the very fabric of our reality. An example of which is the idea of the Philosopher's Stone, a remarkable substance that alchemists aim to create as it had the power to transform base metals into gold and grant immortality to humans. Even in a modern spiritual context, the Philosopher's Stone represents the transformation of oneself 
by attaining spiritual perfection and eternal life. But you might be wondering, how are the Freemasons and the Illuminati connected? Well, there might be no concrete evidence to prove their direct connection, but both the societies did have a similar emphasis. Knowledge, enlightenment, and most importantly, secrecy, which is why many believe they are associated in some way, and the knowledge they have kept secret for centuries is similar. So now, let us delve into the most important part, the hidden knowledge of these secret societies. The knowledge that has been hidden by the Freemasons or the Illuminati for centuries is often referred to as the hidden wisdom, and it encompasses many profound spiritual, scientific, and metaphysical insights. Let's explore some of the key concepts, but be warned, your understanding of the spiritual and the physical realm might be fully transformed after unlocking these secrets. Firstly, and most importantly, their hidden teachings included profound insights on the nature of reality that is completely different from how we perceive reality in a physical manner. According to their teachings, the concept of reality is not merely the physical world that we perceive with our five basic senses. In fact, that is just a tiny part of reality and there are higher and deeper dimensions of our existence. This is where spiritual beings and forces operate from. This is actually reality. And the physical world we interact with is actually just a manifestation of these higher realms. This teaching extends to the fact that if we grasp and fully understand the spiritual laws that govern these higher realms, we can influence and shape our reality however we want. Yes, this means you can become a co-creator of your reality along with the universe. Secondly, another profound knowledge possessed by these secret societies was the power of symbols. The Freemasons and the Illuminati are believed to contain and convey their spiritual truths from one generation to the other in the form of symbols. For example, the Freemasons use symbols such as a square and compass, a pentagram or the all-seeing eye, all of which represent various important aspects of their teachings. These symbols are not a mere physical design, but rather they are thought to be the keys that can help us unlock deeper levels of understanding of the universe. Even in modern spiritual contexts, symbols hold profound significance, but we are really not using it to their full potential, unlike these secret societies. Another strong focus of these secret societies was on the process of alchemy. The process of alchemy refers to a sense of transformation of the self from a state of ignorance to a state of enlightenment in both a literal and a metaphorical context. If we go a bit too literal, the process of alchemy is turning base metals into gold, but this process also acts as a profound metaphor that represents the refinement of our soul. The metaphor of alchemy refers to impurities being removed from our soul, so our true essence can be revealed, and we can connect with it to unlock our best reality. In the alchemical traditions, the Philosopher's Stone is a key element which acts as a symbol of the ultimate goal of these secret societies, achieving spiritual perfection. Just like symbols and alchemy, rituals are also an essential aspect of these secret societies as they serve as a means of connecting with higher powers and accessing hidden spiritual knowledge within the universe. The rituals these societies perform may seem strange on the first glance, but they actually involve profound symbolic actions chants and invocations that are designed in a way that they perfectly align the individual with the profound cosmic forces. Through these spiritual rituals, these individuals aim to undergo a process of profound spiritual transformation that can help them unlock the many mysteries of the universe and use them to unveil their best spiritual self. Last, but very definitely not the last, one of the most significant teachings of these secret spiritual societies is the concept of a divine plan. The Freemasons and the Illuminati have a deep belief that is a divine plan or order 
that governs the whole universe and all its events, including the life of each and every one of us. It is believed that this plan is hidden from ordinary perception, but through the use of spiritual insights and revelations, we can understand this plan and make sense of it. In fact, secret societies like the Freemasons and the Illuminati were apparently aware of this plan and worked towards its fulfillment, so they could guide themselves towards a higher state of consciousness. But that's not all. A central part of many spiritual teachings, especially those associated with the Freemasons and the Illuminati, is the profound concept of the Third Eye. The concept of the Third Eye is a significant concept all around the world, and it spans different time periods. Even in Hinduism, the concept of the Third Eye is a significant one, and it is associated with the Ajna Chakra, which is located within the center of our forehead. This Third Eye is believed to be the seat of our intuition, insight, and higher states of consciousness. To explain it better, in the words of Deepak Chopra, the third eye is the gateway to higher consciousness, and it allows us to access the wisdom of the ages. Indeed, through the third eye, we can unlock more wisdom than ever before. By making use of the third eye, we can perceive realities beyond the mere material world, thus unlocking the gateway to spiritual enlightenment. When our third eye is activated, we can access higher dimensions of existence, communicate with different spiritual entities, and gain profound insights into the nature of reality and the many mysteries of how the universe works. While we're in this activated state, our sense of awareness is heightened, due to which we can transcend the limitations of ordinary perception and we can experience a deeper connection with the divine. The activation of the third eye has profound benefits. You transcend the ego, you attain a sense of unity with the universe, and most importantly, you go through spiritual awakening and develop a deeper understanding of reality and of the universe. But this process doesn't come without its challenges. During this process, you have to overcome any material desires and fully purify your mind, which can be a challenge for some. If we talk about secret societies, the concept of the third eye represents their ability to access hidden rivers of knowledge that have been kept secret for centuries and are only passed through rituals or symbols. But the current era is referred to as the Great Awakening Era, which is a time when hidden truths are being revealed. Humanity is beginning to embrace spiritual insights and use it to awaken to its full spiritual potential. Don't be mistaken. This awakening process is more merely a physical or intellectual process, but it's a spiritual one. And during this journey, individuals become more aware of their true nature and the mysteries that lie in the universe beyond the material world. In this new era of enlightenment, humanity is going through a shift in consciousness, which means individuals are moving away from materialism and towards a more holistic understanding of life. Because of this, the secrets that were kept by the Freemasons and the Illuminati for centuries are coming to light as part of this awakening. As more people start to get spiritually awakened and explore their spiritual potential, the knowledge that was once hidden is becoming more accessible to more people. In particular, a key aspect of this awakening era is the activation of the third eye. As individuals are starting to perceive the world beyond the physical realm, humanity is connecting with higher states of existence, which can lead to a greater sense of purpose, clarity, and connection with the divine. This awakening phase has profound potential as it can bring about a new way of living for us, where we are guided by wisdom, compassion, and a deep understanding of the interconnectedness of the whole universe and all living beings within it. However, the fact that this profound knowledge was hidden by secret societies for so long raises an important question. Why was it secret? And what exactly happens now that it's revealed to a wider audience? Well, firstly, 
A main reason why this knowledge was kept a secret for so long was the fact that such knowledge is way too powerful to be provided to those who are not spiritually prepared to handle it. For example, the process of activation of the third eye has a lot of benefits, but it also comes with significant changes in our perception and our consciousness. For someone who is not spiritually ready, these changes can be overwhelming or even dangerous. This means the secrecy acts as a form of protection for us, ensuring that it only reaches those that are actually ready to receive and understand it. Another reason why this knowledge was kept secret is the fact that it has the potential to be misused. For example, with this knowledge comes the ability to influence reality, which may be used for selfish or destructive purposes if it falls into the wrong hands. So, by keeping this knowledge hidden, secret societies are actually safeguarding humanity from the dangers of too much power. However, the fact that this knowledge is now beginning to reach a wider audience is mainly because humanity is going through its awakening era, which means we are finally reaching a point where we may be ready to understand these secrets and use them in the best way. As humanity is becoming increasingly interested in spiritual practices such as meditation, yoga, and mindfulness, our third eye is becoming activated, which means we have a heightened sense of awareness and a deeper desire for spiritual enlightenment. As more and more individuals become familiar with this knowledge, it has the profound potential to completely shift human consciousness. As the third eye awakens and we access higher levels of awareness, we can start to see the world in a whole new light. We start to understand how everything in the universe is interconnected. This profound shift can lead to a transformation in how we live our life, how we interact with others around us, and most importantly, how we perceive our place in the universe. In conclusion, the secrets guarded by the Freemasons and the Illuminati for centuries, including the nature of reality, the power of symbols, the process of alchemy, the role of rituals, and the concept of a divine plan, have the potential to transform our understanding of reality and our purpose in the universe. As we enter a new era of enlightenment, we are finally ready to seek this knowledge and elevate our whole existence to a higher state of consciousness. But remember, with this powerful knowledge also comes a great responsibility. As we unlock the mysteries of the universe, we must ensure that we do so with a sense of commitment to the greater good of humanity and not any selfish reasons. Hopefully, this video helped you. Make sure to leave any feedback or insights in the comments down below.